What's up, beautiful people? Welcome back to another vlog. One of the first days that we actually have free after unpacking i mean don't get me wrong we're still not done unpacking but today we have some free time to go get some things that we need so we're actually going to be going to target and ikea and a few other places so we're going to take you guys along with us this morning's been a little hectic we've been we spent a lot of our morning trying to get tickets to the lovers and friends fest i don't know if you guys have heard about it but you know it's a really nice lineup a festival that's going to be in vegas next year kind of they're kind of doing it i guess like coachella but not coachella it's a two-day thing so we've been trying and trying to get tickets to it and have been wildly unsuccessful so <laughs> disappointing but we're still gonna try so anyways let me just tell you guys what i'm wearing because so cute so this i'm wearing this pink top from zara i'm wearing some pink flowy pants from zara too and then this is my zara necklace my a necklace and this i can't remember where i got this necklace but um i just think that they pair really nice together but uh also we are slightly matching today i know we actually fun fact we actually do love to match but we just haven't really had the opportunity and today we're both actually wearing pink Okay, so uh, love that for us. Oh, and don't mind the mess behind me. We're still figuring out where everything goes, so. Hey, look who showed up to the party with some salmon-colored pants, okay? Hello, hello. Are we seeing this? Check out my fresh. Are we seeing this, though? I think we're gonna have to get a picture. Sheesh. Okay, the salmon pants I'm loving. Pink? Oh my God, I love when you wear pink, girl. Looking all <laughs> gorgeous. Wee. Okay, so I've been to every Target in the area and they all seem to be sold out of the comforters. I don't understand what's going on. All the white linen stuff is gone. I really like these balls. I don't know if they're just like serving things or you can actually eat out of them. I also like these. What nice is that? Like a matte black? Um, and the cutting boards with the marble. curtain rods are like the main thing that I came here for and of course they're all gone. I don't understand what is happening with my luck. I like these because oh, yeah. they have the matte in, uh, yeah. insert. I can't remember what it's After called, all but they that. have that insert. Yeah. 
so we were somewhat successful, but a lot of the stuff that I wanted was actually sold out. I don't know if it's because there's so many people building new houses out here or what's going on, but everything that I wanted was sold out. So hopefully better luck next time. So good, so good. I got it with the um, hot Cheeto thing on the outside. Mm. Mm. So today we were planning to go to the mall and do some other things like that, but mother nature had other plans for us. As you could see that emergency warning, um, so we woke up to a flash flood uh, raining today. So I think that's a sign that I need to stay inside and get more things together. So that's probably what we're gonna do today. Maybe still go to the gym and stuff like that, but the streets are flooded, so. Today we are probably just going to meal prep, go to the gym and do some things like that. But I did wanna show you guys something. So I was doing a little shop on Zara and usually when I shop on Zara, I will use an app to kind of like put outfits together and see if I like the items together or not. And I figured like, why don't I show you guys? Because it, this is honestly my best tip of putting outfits together. And it's something that I use all the time for all the clothes that I get. And um, it's just the most helpful tip that I can give when it comes to putting outfits together. So let me show you that really quick. Okay, so whenever I'm doing my shopping on Zara or I'm planning like a haul video and I need to put outfits together or even just outfits for myself, um, I will go into my saved section and I will select the items that I think will look good together and I'll select it just like that. I'll scroll down until it's just the clothing item by itself like this and then I'll screenshot it and I will go into, sorry about my janky nail, I'm getting my nails fixed, um, but I will go into this app called Unfold, favorite app ever, and then I will create a story and when I do this I always use the same format because I really like the way it looks, it's very simple and it works for putting multiple items together. So I'll go to this format right here. It's in the Classico One um, collection. So I'll select that and this is where you can pick your pictures. So I have screenshots here, so I will select this one. And I'll just put it like that. I'll click it and then I'll zoom in and then I'll just bring it down like that so that it fits into the square. And if you don't fill in all these squares, that's totally fine. The background will just turn white. So when I'm done putting an outfit together, I'll show you like kind of what it looks like. So these are all outfits that I'm planning to do for a haul. So let's go to this one. I've put this whole outfit together right here and I just really like the format and I really like that I can actually see what my outfit is gonna look like. I can decide here if something goes with something else or if it doesn't go, if I don't like the way it looks together. It's just a really easy way to get a really, a much better idea than just putting it together in your head. So that's my little tip on how I put my outfits together, especially for hauls. When I'm doing a haul, I really like to plan and make things cohesive. I don't do this every single time I do a haul. Obviously, sometimes I just, 
pick some random things that, that I think in my head will go well. But if I'm like really planning something out or I really wanna have some nice looking specific kind of outfits and I'm not sure how they're gonna look together, I definitely use that app. I even use it for like my own outfits. So if you're ever stuck on what to wear, you can always just go into your app and look at the outfits that you put together. And that's another great thing that I love about it is I just honestly love having it as like an outfit planner. Um, that's just me. Come here. Are you feeling better? Yes, you're my baby dog. Okay. He's like, no, mom. No, mom. shopping um, I had to get some new things for the apartment so I figured I would just do a little haul with you guys and show you guys what I got um, so first stop was home goods and I got these under the sink organizers for all of my like hair products and things that go under the sink in my bathroom it came in this like three-piece set I love that they're clear so you can see exactly what you're looking for then I got these also from Home Goods for to put in my closet. I'm thinking like jewelry and other miscellaneous things. It's like a two pack thing. It has a rubber insert in the bottom. I love that. I got some dish towels. I got beige because I feel like our apartment has a lot of cool colors and I really wanted to bring some warmth into the apartment. I may have like Kind of a beigey earth tone jute rug coming pretty soon so i figured these would just look nice and kind of tie all of that in got some oven mitts because those are a must i got some pet wipes because if you have a dog like a frenchie or a dog that has like wrinkles or folds in their skin or anything like that you know how important these things are to keep them clean and make sure that they don't get like irritated skin and things like that and now for some of my bigger purchases this week. You guys saw us do our shopping trip at Target. Uh, we did pick up this coffee machine. It's a Ninja and it does more than just regular coffee. It does all kinds of specialty coffee, which is exactly what I need in my life because I am the kind of person that likes change. I like to switch up my drink. I like different things. I get bored of the same thing all the time. So. It has a frother, it does tea, it does like brewed coffee, um, cappuccinos and lattes, iced coffee, really important for me, things like that. And this is what it looks like out of the box. The frother thing just kind of like folds back, back there. And then you have the scoop on the side. But um, yeah, and then it has a digital clock, all the different settings. And for the biggest purchase that I think I've made for my home besides furniture, um, and honestly one of my favorite purchases I think I've invested in in quite a while is the Dyson Animal. 
If you have hardwood floors like us or like laminate floors or something like that, you can see all the hair on the ground and sometimes sweeping and mopping just to me, I just feel like in a place like this, especially with light, lighter colored floors, sweeping and mop mopping just doesn't do the job well enough. So this Dyson animal is perfect for a home with a pet. I love it because I can vacuum the pet hair off of my couch. I have a light colored couch now, so that is really important. Um, I use this thing almost every day. It gets on top of the baseboards. It gets on top of the windowsills. I freaking love this thing and I literally use it every day. Okay, another thing that we picked up from Target when you guys saw us shopping that day is this cute diffuser. I love the color of this diffuser. There's a few reasons why I chose this one. I got one for our kids' room and then I got one for our room. So it has this ring right here is a nightlight. You um, just fill it with water and put the oil in there and then you turn it on and it has different mist settings but on top of that it also has ambient noise and sort of like soothing noises so it's not just a diffuser and a nightlight. It's, it has like spa noises. That's exactly what it reminds me of. It's kind of like being at a spa so. And the neutral color is perfect. And then the last thing I got is this dog bed. And as you can see, Zeus loves it. <laughs> he started laying on it as soon as I brought it in the house. I think because it's kind of like a memory foam type of thing. And he hasn't had like a dog bed he could lay on. He doesn't like to go in his crate voluntarily unless it's like time for bed. So he had nowhere to lay and he was constantly trying to lay on the couch. And I just wanted to get him out of that bad habit because, you know, his dog hair shows up everywhere on the couch. So I got him this dog bed and I think he loves it. Oh, baby dog. Here's my baby dog. <laughs> I also got this under the counter like shelf thing so you can put bins on top and bins underneath to maximize your space. Okay, we are going to tackle this under sink today. It's a lot to do, but Zeus, you're gonna help me? You're gonna help me organize? I don't understand why you're supposed to know. so far. This bucket, this one. Okay, we are headed out for the day. We're probably going to go get something to eat, go to the mall, something like that. And just because Dante is going back to work soon and uh, the kids are finally in school again, so we want to take advantage of the time that we have together during the day to go do things together before he goes back to work and I'm here alone during the day. So that's exactly what we're gonna do. Just wanted to show you really quickly what I'm wearing. Okay, so I'm wearing these green shoes from Zara. These are my kind of like art limited edition shorts from Zara. This is just a random white t-shirt that I got from Walmart and I'm wearing my green Zara bag. Um, is there anything else I'm forgetting to, sh to mention? Uh, shades are from Amazon. I've said that before. Jewelry is random. And also, you looking gorgeous. Woo woo. Look at that. Look at the stylist. Thank you. And today, with the matching outfit, the Zara Snoopy shirt, green Zara shorts, and then just obviously a Celtics hat. Didn't put his shoes on yet. Um, but he's going to be wearing Air Force Ones, white Air Force Ones, but look how cute. We're very matchy-matchy today. Green. Hello. Love that.
Time to go in, baby. I got the Norris barbecue shrimp with sourdough bread. It looks so good. And then he got the chew, you know? Look at that thing. So yummy. I love seafood. Oh, here we go. I eat seafood. Here we go. Every day. Oh every God. day. Lunch, anyway, dinner, anyway, lunch, dinner. Dinner. Okay, we just finished eating. It was pretty good. Um, I didn't realize that my Bloody Mary had like horseradish in it. I know that traditionally they're usually made with that, but I do not like horseradish, okay? We're gonna try to rush and go to the Scottsdale Fashion Center is what they call their malls out here um, so that we can make it back in time to pick up the kids. Such a cute little summer dress. A little side cutout. I love that. All right, you guys. It is not the end of the vlog until I show you the Zara delivery that I just got. So I'm gonna give you a sneak peek of a video that I'm planning right now. Um, obviously, you're not gonna see me try it on and style it because that's what the haul is for, but I decided to give my vlogs a sneak peek just to give you something really exciting to look forward to. Okay, so in the mail today, I did receive a few items, a few goodies. Let's start with this. What is she? I don't know. What could it be? It's in a bag. Let's find out. Yes, it is a bra, but... I am obviously not going to be wearing it like that with the world to see all of my goods, okay? But we are going to use this as a bralette. How pretty is she? Just a beautiful nude lace bralette. The perfect little bralette to go under an outfit. I love this little strap detail right here. So cute. And then I got this white satin button-up shirt coming in clutch for my outfits that I'm planning. Oh my goodness, and these, these orange pants, I know that you've seen them on the website, okay? I got them so that you guys can see how they fit without having to buy them first, okay? Coming in clutch for the girls, I'm gonna tell you exactly what I think about these. Oh my God, look at that color, just look at that. Next are these gorgeous emerald green satin pants. Look at the detail. Okay, wait. Look at the detail on the side. And then they kind of split at the bottom here, kind of a relaxed satin pant look. I am absolutely in love with these pants. I cannot wait for you guys to see them on. And then, of course, I'm sure you guys have seen this green skirt before. She will also be featured in the video. This is the green skirt that has that slit at the bottom there. Still in with the greens, okay? The greens are not going away yet. Anyways, thank you so much for watching this week's vlog. I'm going to try to make this a weekly thing every single week. We'll see how it goes. But I will be adding fashion content into all of my vlogs since that's what you guys are here for and I'm trying to give you what you want. Um, leave a comment down below and let me know what you thought of the vlog, what you think I need to add, if I should change anything. I really want to hear your guys' feedback, obviously, because I'm doing it for you. So again, don't forget to subscribe and I'll see you on Sunday with a fashion video.